Good evening guys, how you doing? Hope you guys are doing well. So I've just arrived in uh, Phuket in Patong tonight and uh, I've come to this place for a foot massage and uh, I'm going to show you the place once I've finished here and then I'm going to be showing you guys my uh, my hotel down in uh, Kapui village. Uh, so if you guys want to have a massage here, um, a foot massage will cost you 200 baht, uh, you can have a f oil massage for 300 baht, uh, and I'll try and get more prices uh, in the week so I can uh, <clears throat> put a text of uh, some of the massages that they do here. Uh, this is quite close to a street food stall, by the way, uh, where you can get like pad thai and uh, other Thai foods there for about 100 baht. Uh, I got a meal tonight for, <clears throat> what did I get? I got a soft drink, some water, and a meal, and it came to 170 baht. So, very, very affordable and uh, not expensive, unlike some other restaurants around this uh, hot area. So, I look forward to showing you guys where this place is, so that if you need to come yourself, then... Uh, you'll know where to come. So this is the place you want to come for if you want a foot massage, tar massage, uh, oil massage. And it's just on this main road here. Uh, so down there, we're gonna take a little walk in a minute and go towards uh, the Capri Village Hotel. And if you want a Pad Thai or anything like that, you got all the Thai foods here. Uh, I ate here and they've got like a couple of tables where you can sit down and it's just by this place here right by the money exchange right here ตะเพียงแขนแล้วโตตรงนี้ครับอาจารย์เดียวเลยอาจารย์ก็ซ้ําติดตาสเปรย์ช็อปเคยตะลิสเปรย์ครับโอเคมันใจอ่ะแบบ
And uh, whenever you're in Thailand too, you'll always um, find these little places where you can get a little pa pancake if you want to too. So if you want like, a little snack here, uh, you can always get a banana pancake if you want to too. Uh, you'll see them roaming around. Uh, you can uh, you got a place for a massage there too. Uh, you got a place where you can get food, but they seem to be closed at the moment. So we're going to continue our walk now along this main road here and uh, it will lead to my hotel. Uh, on the corner we've got a bar and restaurant along this side here. Uh, they'll be having a live band later. Uh, you've got the Hotel Indigo down here too. Um, if you need any taller trees or anything like that you've got uh, Watsons along this side here. Uh, you got a pharmacy all on this side of you as well. There's a spa there on the right hand side there. Uh, you've got the butcher's garden here too, which is just inside of there. Okay. This gives you a good idea of uh, some of the restaurants in this area. Uh, you can have a tapas in this place here. If you want a tapas. And whenever you come to Phuket too, you'll see those taxis. You've got the red taxi and uh, you've got the yellow taxi as well. And sometimes always uh, be beam out loud music. Ah, uh, so we got naughty nervies in this corner here. So it's a bar and restaurant along that side there. And whenever you're walking along these paths too, just be careful of the the, the holes and. Uh, and stuff because you might end up tripping over, tripping over. So just be careful there. Uh, we've got some fruits along here. Ah, uh, you got some of the bars along that side there. Uh, you got Roscoe's restaurant and sports bar across there too. And uh, you'll find quite a few um, places where you can actually book a tour to. No, thank you, the old cab. Hi, we're in the busy area of Phuket. Um, another London style um, taxi in Phuket. Uh, the other day I saw one in uh, Bangkok. And now I've seen one in Phuket. So that must be a new thing in Thailand that I've, not, I've recently discovered. On the left, we've got the Royal Paradise Hotel and Spa on the left up there. Uh, we've got the 517 Fisherman Seafood on the right hand side there. So if you're into your seafood, then this area has quite a few seafood restaurants where you can enjoy seafood. Um, if you want to go shopping, there's a few stalls along this side here. Um, they've got the coconut place along here too. A place to change money. Uh, we've got a few massage places along this side here. So, there's a, a lot to do in this area, so you can never be bored in this area, do you know what I mean? You know, Pekka has something for everybody. Partying, uh, 
the stuff for families to do too. Plenty of street foods. A load of places for foot massage, time massages along here. <laughs> Right, further down here is where my hotel is. The, where the blue board is, that's where my hotel is. So we are really close now. Uh, another massage and salon place on the right there. Uh, we've got the Nip Tooney Hotel on the right here, which is in there. Another place where you can book a tour. If you guys want a shawarma, there's a shawarma place here. Why we've arrived guys. So this is the Capri Village Hotel. So this is where I'm staying. So to give you guys uh, an idea where it is. So this is in Potonia, the Capri Village Hotel. It's directly opposite the coffee club, cafe, bar, and restaurant. And we've walked all the way down there from where I had my massage. So we're going to go for a little tour now. And also there's a little convenience store here too, which is really, really handy. So let's check out my room. But when you check in, you check in at this place here. And also, uh, and it's just down here. When you come down here, it's quiet. So you might get one or two people sitting outside here. Uh, but that's it, it's quiet around here. So you're away from the, the noise from outside of the hotel here. Absolutely amazing. And uh, my room is just further down here. Just through this bit here. And uh, so this is the pool. Uh, so it's a bit dark. Um, but I'll put a picture of the daylight version so you can get an idea what it looks like. And uh, that is uh, my room. So let me open up and then I'll show you. So we're inside my room at the Capri Village Hotel in Poton. So I've got a king size bed here, which is really, really good. Uh, you've got your PowerPoints. Uh, you've got your switches. Uh, let me just switch on the light here. There we go. Um, so you've got the flat screen TV here. Uh, you get a couple of towels per day here. Uh, you get toilet paper. Uh, you get a couple of bottles of water per day here and by the way when you come here do not throw the gl glasses in the bin because they recycle them you've got a kettle all your coffees tea there's a fridge here so you can buy beers put it inside that fridge there if you want to the remote control for the aircon it's got a nice lamp there too which is good so that's the view and that is a sliding door of when you come into this room. Uh, so this is the bathroom here. So you've got a safe deposit box, a hairdryer, a few hammers to put your clothes. Uh, you've got a sink. You get some toiletries here too. And you also get a bar soap too. And uh, you've got the toilet, the bath. To stay at this hotel, for five nights in Paton, in Paquette, has cost me um, under 8,000, but I'll put the exact amount down below of how much it costs for me to stay here. Uh, but I'm looking forward to staying here, relaxing, checking out Paquette, and going to other areas of Paquette. So I hope you guys like this video of where to go for a good massage, where to get cheap Thai food, uh, a little walk towards the hotel and uh, showing you guys my hotel in Potona Paquette. 
If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks a lot for watching. Stay safe, stay healthy, God bless, and hope to see you guys in the next one.